A big announcement this midweek out of New Hampshire. Governor Chris Sununu won't run for re-election in 2024. The 48 year old has led the Granite State since 2017, serving four terms. Sununu hasn't said what his plans are yet, but in a statement he wrote, quote, public service should never be a career and the time is right for another Republican to lead our great state. In June, Sununu announced he would not run for president and he surprised many in 2021 when he decided against challenging incumbent Maggie Hassan for the U.S. Senate. As to who a next leader may be, former New Hampshire Senator Kelly Ayotte put out a statement hinting at big news in the coming days. Ayotte was senator from 2011 to 2017 and served as the state's attorney general from 2004 to 2009. In that statement, Ayotte wrote, quote, the battle to ensure New Hampshire keeps our live free or die spirit must continue. Like many Granite Staters, I fear that we are one election away from turning into Massachusetts, end quote. Former president of the New Hampshire Senate, Chuck Morse, wants the corner office. In his announcement, Morse said he's proud to have worked with Sununu to create a, quote, pro-jobs, family-first economic agenda. Morse ran in the Republican primary for U.S. Senate last year, but lost to Don Bolduck. For Democratic candidates, Manchester Mayor Joyce Craig announced she's running. That was last week. Craig was the city's first woman elected mayor in 2017. Executive Councilor Cindy Warmington is running as well. Warmington announced her campaign at the beginning of June. She was elected to the Executive Council from District 2 in 2020.